Hello everyone. In this video, I will be taking you through the usage of Scopus. Scopus is an abstract and citation database which provides information on peer-reviewed journals, books and conference proceedings on a variety of subjects. It allows you to have a look at the major trends regarding your research field. For accessing Scopus database, you need to first go to your college library website. Click on the e-resources. Go to e-databases. And here is a list of all the subscribed e-databases available. You can access the database by clicking over the link here. You can search for the documents directly from the search tab here and also from the filters provided on your left hand side. You can add more search fields if you want to using the boolean operators. And there is also an option to provide documents on a specific date range. Here you need to specify your date and year range and when it is added to Scopus. The next menu helps you to search for the documents based on the author details. You can search using the author name, ORC ID and the keywords used by the author. Here are some of the popular searches carried out in this Scopus the affiliation menu helps us to search for the documents under a particular institution. Now these are the number of documents and the number of authors under this affiliation. The total number of documents are categorized accordingly for easy access. If I want to access a document under engineering, these are the number of results. You can search within the results using this refine options provided. You can also order the documents based on the date of publishing, citations received, etc. The queries that you search for can be edited, it can be saved for later use and you can set alert as well. All the information related to the document title, authors and sources are available here itself. You just have to click on it to access the additional information. You can also view the abstract by clicking on view abstracts or show all abstract option. All the information related to the document, the authors and the sources are available here itself. You just have to click on it to access the additional information. If I want to access the author details, all the information relating to the author is available here. Starting from the author information, his subject areas, the most contributed topics of the author. You can analyze the output of author by clicking here. A detailed review on the type of publications, the documents by source, where he has published the trend of publications, the subject areas that he is focusing on, h and -H, citations received, all the information is available here. So you get a detailed review of the author. By clicking on the sources menu, you will get information about all the journals, books, conference proceedings indexed in Scopus. You can also further categorize it based on the year, you can search for a source based on quartiles. Quartile reflects the demand for the journal by the scientific community. Lastly, Scopus provides research discovery where you can find and connect with researchers from around the globe. 